Hey guys, I'm gonna show you how to draw a wolf. This is such a creative wolf, so I, my friend taught me, Michaela. You should go check out her video. But I tried to search it up, but I couldn't find it. I'm sorry, Michaela, if you're watching this. But other viewers, please try your best. If you see it, if if you seen her, please please leave it down in the comments below. And let's get started. So first you're gonna draw a circle. Okay, I just broke. <laughs> Sorry if I'm wasting time. But at least draw a circle about like this. A circle about like that. And then you're just going to draw some lines across. But not regular lines. Look. So you're going to draw a line that way, facing that way. Because the wolf is going to be facing that way, not straight ahead or that way. You can do it that way. It's going to be a bit challenging. Actually, you can, but it's going to be challenging if you change the body. So next, you're going to draw a line across. Just like that. You see? Just like that, so it should be turning out like this. And then next, you're gonna draw the eyes. You're just gonna draw two circles. Don't make them close together. Like that. About like two circles. And then we're going to draw the eyes in the middle. Uh, okay. Make sure they're good enough for the wolf eyes to go good with its body. So something like this. And then you erase you you erase the outer lines from the eye. We keep the inner lines in the circle. It's okay if you accidentally erase the middle of the eye, the, the middle of the circle. My, my mistake, sorry. And then we're gonna do the other one. Make sure you're really careful. Make sure you erase about all of it. There shouldn't be something left. Like that. So it should turn out like this. And you don't have to redraw the lines because the draw yes, you're gonna erase the lines at the end. Until so next you're gonna draw the eye. So basically you're gonna draw a triangle like that. Like that. And you're gonna draw triangles like this. But I made a little mistake. That's okay, because I'm I'm meant to draw the eye the other way. Because you know that the wolf is facing that way. You can't make the wolf that way or facing forward. So it's going to turn out like that. And then you're going to color them in. Don't, don't color them in too dark. Which is going to turn out like that. And then you're going to draw circles. You're gonna draw circles at the back of the eye like that. Like, not too big. I about like to fill a little space. Make sure you draw at the back of each eye. Like, something like, like this. I also want to tell you, if I'm going too fast, you can pause the video. And I'll leave it here at, so you can pause it. Okay, next you're gonna make the eye realistic. That's my favorite part. So you're gonna basically you're going to draw little lines at the end. Like little lines like that around with both eyes. It'll make them all the way to the center. And don't and don't draw them into that into the white, into the white circle that you made. Like this. You see the little lines? Basically, you're gonna draw it with that, and then next, you are going to draw the the mouth. 
like so the mouth is going to go like that and then you just draw down like like basically you're doing it like that and then you're just going to draw right back up like this but don't do it all the way up back up to the face like on the other eye that's not how a wolf mouth goes and then next you're going to draw a circle at the end and then draw a line across it like that and then you're just going to shade in the top you can do it dark you can do it light it's up to you I'm just gonna do it dark so so you, so you, you can see and then next that's how it should look I'm gonna pause it you could pause the video so it can look like that make sure you shade every part don't leave any white and then next you're going to want to erase the lines in the middle like that are that are like up, like like that like that were over the wolf mouth and then next going to draw the mouth like the mouth opening so basically you see basically you're going to draw it like down and then going down way make it like a little bit better like a little bit longer i meant sorry let me say it's okay if you erase the line no mistake it's there's always mistakes in drawing and you have to erase so that should look like and then and then you're going to draw some little lines about as much as you want but make sure it doesn't fill the whole the whole nose and then you're just going to draw two on each make sure they're long enough to go out the mouth like to go longer than the mouth part and then you can shade it in with some other whiskers like that so it should, it should look like that Make sure you shade it. Well, it doesn't have to be shaded, but you can do it. And then you're going to draw a little bit on the side. Like that. So it should look like that when you're done. And then next, you are we're, we are moving on to the eyes. So you're basically just going to draw a few lines coming out the eyes. Uh, coming out in front of the eye like that and then so it should look like that when you're when you're done with the with the eyes then next you're going to draw the ears the ears are a tad bit challenging so when you're drawing the ears like you're, like when you're drawing this ear like right here that yeah it's gonna be a tad bit challenging so basically you're drawing a file like this like you're drawing it like this and then go straight down like that I'll show you so like that and then go straight down you see a little swerve on it basically you're kind of drawing a flower but you just after that you just go straight down and then you're just going to draw a little hair a little hair like that sorry if it's getting out of the camera like a little hair and then you're going to draw the next ear. But basically you're just going to draw a triangle. But a little curved triangle. Sorry, I'm so sorry because the hole is there. I'm, I, think, I didn't get to complete it. That's okay. I drew a bit high. But I'll draw some other pictures on the other side. So that should it, that should it look like. And then you're just going to draw some squiggles like that. Make sure they go all the way to the top, like this. But you're gonna like doing it like like an ear, like that. So basically, it's gonna turn out like this. And then you're gonna lightly shade the inside, very lightly. Do not do it dark. Dark shading, light, lightness, and darkness are very important. Make sure you shade over the shaggy. Make sure you shade over the squiggles too. Just to make it look natural.
Then I'm gonna do the next one, but not the same. I'm going to do. I'm going to do a little bit like that, basically like like that little. Then you just have to shade it in very lightly again. Yeah, I make the eyebrows a bit bigger. So it should look like that. I made the eyebrows look bigger. You can make them bigger. You can keep them short. You don't. You don't have to add bad eyebrows. It's just your wolf, creative wolf. The next, we're going to draw something at the at back of the head. So we're gonna draw uh, not not too out. Like that. Like just like that. You see? At the end, you see, like right here. Now we're gonna move on to the neck. You see that I, I draw the neck like right there into the whiskers. Like right there. You see it right there. But make sure you do it dark and then I wrote it down there too. And then you're gonna draw the body. Yeah, this is too big body. I'm sorry. <laughs> I, you can you can laugh at me. It's okay. It, it makes mistakes. I laugh at myself too. That's too big. That's too small. Okay, that should be perfect. So it looks it should look like that. Next, you're going to draw the legs. So you're going to draw the circle first. Always remember, this is just the basics of drawing. And then you're just going to draw it down, but not too down. And then you're just going to draw it like that. So we're going to do this, continue on with the legs. But when you're doing the second one, you're going to make the circle a tad bit bigger. But until you go to like the third one, until you go like to the third one, you have to... You have to make a little line like that. And then we're gonna do the same with the last one. Like that. So it should look like that when you're done. And then next, we're going to draw the paws. The paws are pretty hard. So, so look very closely, as you can see, draw Make sure you draw the outer cover of the of the paw. So I draw the outer cover of the paw. See? So basically you're drawing a line straight down and then across. Bas sorry if it's like off the screen. Like that. Make sure you draw it dark. So you can so you won't make a mistake erasing that on accident. Yeah, that's okay, but you can still see the line. Make sure it's dark. You're gonna do it with all it it for you for you to have the paw like like that, like if it's walking like that, it depends on it depends on how you wanna do it. So you're gonna you want you're gonna want to erase the outer lines out of on outside of the paw. Okay, so you see that accidentally erased? We're gonna just redraw it back up. Okay, like that. So let me out re outline. So basically, it's like that. And then you're gonna draw three humps on the top. On each, on every one. On every one of these paws. Make sure you re reline it too. So it's gonna look like this when you're done. Then you're just gonna draw two lines, only two lines where they're like, where it's coming down a little on each. You can pause the video if that's okay. I'll let, I'll put, I'll put you a finishing picture while I'm pausing the video. And then you're just going to draw like R's. 
just to show the claws. Make sure you do it on each of the three sides, like each on the each on the three toes. So it's gonna look like that. Like, look, you see the art? It's gonna look like that. And then you're gonna draw some lines, like squiggly lines, squiggly lines like that. You see? And then it's gonna continue it down the leg to all of them. So it's gonna look like that when you're done. I'll put the pausing picture. Next, you're going to draw this, you're gonna draw the tummy. So basically you're gonna draw the tummy like, like that. So basically the tummy is like that. And then you're going to draw the tail. Okay, actually, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm, so sorry. I'm, not, I'm not an expert, but my friend taught me. So you're just going to draw any type of lines. Any type of lines on there. So it's like, it should look like this. Any type of squiggles you want, unless it's like a few long ones. You're going to draw the circle. You're going to draw a circle just to represent the tail. Make sure the circle looks like it's going downwards, like this. And then next, next you're gonna draw like the it like another one, but make sure make sure it's the true one. Like make sure it's the one that's going all the way now. Then I'm gonna erase the outer line. It's very important to draw the outer circle because you did make it a lot confused. So it should look like that. Then I'm gonna erase this line here. Then you're just going to draw the any type any type of shaggy line you want. But at the end make sure it kinda of looks like a triangle. Make sure you go it down the leg. And you're gonna draw a little swiggle line at the end of there. And that's your finished product. And you're going to might erase all the lines there. Like even this line, and not all the way, just to keep it natural. So that's that's your finished product. I hope you liked it. Bye.